The Prime Minister of the UK, Liz Truss, is going to be here. Where have you been? Well, I think we've got to remember the situation we were facing this winter. And Lydia says, are you ashamed of what you've done? Are you? I think we have to remember what situation this country was facing. We were going into the winter with people uh, expected to face fuel bills of up to £6,000, huge rates of inflation. And you've made it worse. But also slowing, slowing economic growth. It's also about how we grow the size of the pie so that everyone can benefit. By borrowing more and putting our mortgages up. We need to borrow more this winter for the energy crisis that we're facing. We're going to put, spend more in mortgage fees under what you've done based on the predictions than we would have saved with energy. I don't think anybody is arguing that we shouldn't have acted on energy. This question that all our listeners have been asking me this morning about fairness in these tax proposals that you've made. But it's not, which it's not fair. It's not fair to have a recession. It's not fair to have a town where you're not getting the investment. Can you guarantee to my listeners this morning that their pensions are safe? Well, the Bank of England does a very, very good job on delivering financial stability. That, and that that, that's is exactly not an answer, Prime Minister. Doing. Can you guarantee yes, no. that people's pensions but I are want safe? To, well, the Bank of England do that and they do a very good job of it. What does local consent look like, Prime Minister? Well, I, the... The, the Energy Secretary will be laying out uh, in more detail exactly what that looks like, but it does me mean making sure there is local support for, for going ahead. And it, I can it, assure it sounds you, like you don't and I can know. Assure, and I can assure Mark Menzies, well, there are, there are various detailed issues to be worked through.